yeah. than us to, to offer. And the thing them. I want to tell people is that when I first text you, I'm like, oh my God, I want to talk to you about your book. And you're like, I haven't written one yet. And I'm like, you need to. <laughs> you know, what's really, what's really funny is that I guess for me, even calling myself a writer was such a like not planned thing. Like mm. I never thought of myself a writer. Yeah. I, obviously now today I can say, you know, without false uh, timidity um, that I, I obviously have a gift, you know, I, 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 I never took a writing class in my, in my life. So mm -hmm. the, the way these words come to me and the way I'm able to present them, mm -hmm. there is something. And I'm actually convinced that the gifts that we've come here with these gifts mm -hmm. to help us become who it is that we're meant to become here. Yeah. So, you know, I discovered this voice, just like yeah. you discovered, you discovered mm -hmm. your art. It's not as, it's not an random, you know, yeah. it's not yeah. random. I feel like it's, it's here for a specific reason. And so- It wants to come out. And it wants to come out. And, that, and that's how it started with me. You know, I just needed to start expressing. I didn't care what form. I just like, mm -hmm. I felt like I needed it for, for me, that was my Sanity, healing reality, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. And then a lot of people started reaching out, you know, about where is your book? Where is your book? And I'm like, <laughs> I don't, like, first of all, I have no idea how to even start, you know? Yeah. Well, um, I, you know what yeah. I think? It's since, like, listening to you from the beginning, you have this beautiful way of articulating in your words. It's also almost poetic. And yeah. I feel like, most books I like to listen to is audio audio books. Right. So right, right. I think it would be beautiful for you for you to write your book as an audio one first and just dictate oh, it. Wow. And just dictate it and and just speak even as you speak to other people, even if you're doing this podcast, once you listen to it again, everything that you say in it is perfectly as an audio book. Oh wow, thank you. That's such an interesting idea. I mean, you know, what 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 I love about what you just said is and this has been my journey really in the last 10 years because I I feel like life is always showing me now that I'm aligned with where I'm supposed to be going, right? Mm -hmm. There's always that like the, the next step is given to me. Mm -hmm. Right? Like I don't need to worry, I don't need to fight for it or like mm -hmm. look for it with a lantern. Like it's yeah. always given to me. Just like the way I started coaching, you know, most of my clients are online and it's global and yeah. you know even two and a half years ago we didn't even know what zoom was mm -hmm. at least i you know i don't <laughs> think it existed yeah. so just i just feel like everything is happening now and all the newness mm -hmm. is here to help us get to where we're going so yeah. i mean what what a crazy idea is that to write a book as an art to start with it being an audience yeah. Yes, and I see I, it, the fun, the beautiful thing is like I I naturally have this in instinctive um I don't know gut feelings and things as mm -hmm. I meet people and like talk to them I just naturally will see like their gifts and yes so as soon as you started speaking and as soon as I saw some of your uh, Instagram and stories I was like we have to have a book but I'll, obviously like I'm like you where I'm more um intuitive of like for me I'm not a writer so I do want to write my book but I'm not a writer and I'm not good with like you know grammatical and all of that okay. stuff so I've never seen myself as a writer so as I tell everybody in my podcast as I'm talking I'm like I want to write a story about my childhood and you know death and, and rediscovering and sexuality and finding my voice um I realized you know what I really should just make it more of an art book because really that's who I am so why am I struggling to try to put myself into a box of like just words it'll be art poetry essays and words so it'll be all encompassing because that's who I am I'm not just words it would have to be my art which is me I love that so much I really do believe in that as well I feel that we you know we need to start taking up more space and sort of disrupt the familiar ways we express ourselves. I think mm -hmm. that's what's yeah. happening. So I think like when you do your Zooms and you're coaching with people, I'm not sure if you've recorded them, but as you rec if you've recorded them, that's your audio book. Like all of your advice that you're giving to people can be a culmination of, of your advices and your sessions. And it could be just like art. I, my, I love doing collage art. So you mm -hmm. can be having like 
if you wanted to start it or bring some that way, we just collect all the things that you said, because really your words are beautiful. Oh, How you speak is so poetic also. And I, I really appreciate you being here. And I really